Here's the list of items you'll need for this brow tutorial. Foundation, spoolie, foundation brush, CoverGirl concealer, LA Pro concealer, CNC concealer, brow pencil, and an angle brush. My foundation is in the shade 355. The LA Girl concealer that I'm using is beige and chestnut. First, you want to take your spoolie and just comb your brows upward and kind of shake them into their natural shape. As you can see, my brows don't really have a natural shape. They're kind of shaped awkward and I need a wax, but I'm going to make the best out of this tutorial. And then you're going to take your brow pencil. This is just a cheap drugstore brow pencil. Um, I do use NYX brow pencil. This pencil is in the color dark brown, if any of you are wondering. So I'm just going to shape the outline of my natural brows. I'm going to shape the bottom first, and then I'm going to shape the top. As you can see, I don't have a tail, so I kind of just draw myself a tail. Okay, listen, this is where a lot of girls get the brow game fucked up at. This is the most important part. You want to fill in your brows, but you don't want to fill in the front, so you don't have that harsh look. You're going to take the end of your spoolie, and just kind of blend it. You want to blend the front of your brows in with the excess brow pencil. You don't want to ever use the brow pencil and shape the front of your brows. So I'm just combing my brows out. Now I'm going to take my LA Girl Concealer and conceal the bottom of my brows. You just kind of want to follow the natural arch of your brows and just, if you don't have an arch, make an arch. Once I completely conceal the bottom of my brows, I'm going to go ahead and start concealing the top of my brows. So the same way I followed the shape of my brows underneath, I'm just going to follow the natural outline of my brows up top. And remember, if you don't have one, make one. So right here, this is the second step for females mess up with their brows. They just leave it like this. They leave it like this. They don't blend the middle. They, they just walk out the house like this. And that's a negative. You want to conceal in between your brows. This is key to not having a unibrow. So I'm gonna go ahead and take my brush and I'm just gonna blend, 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 blend. Like blending is the key to having nice brows. Once I'm done blending the concealer in, I'm going to take my spoolie and I'm going to clean it up. I'm just going to go in and comb and make sure I don't have a unibrow. I would comb it as if these were my natural brows. Then I'm going to take my angle brush and clean it up. If there's any smurfs anywhere, you just want to go under and up top and clean it up. Blend, 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 blend. I know you guys didn't think we were done blending. You just want to take your foundation that's your skin tone, your foundation and your skin tone, and blend. Just blend, blend, blend. Blend like your life depended on it. I'm going to blend the bottom of my brows and I'm blending the top of my brows. Wherever I put concealer, I'm covering it up with foundation. The final step that I do to my brows is comb it out with my spoolie, make sure everything's faded and cleaned up. And I do the um, brow test. So I wanna make sure my tail isn't too long, so I'm just gonna measure it with my spoolie. This is how you know your tail isn't too long. You wanna make sure you don't have a unibrow, you just wanna comb your brows out, and there you have it. Bam. 
popped on my lashes and that's pretty much it if you guys have any questions down below or would like to see more brow videos or where i get my lashes or anything beauty related comment down below what you guys are expecting to see in my next video again don't forget to subscribe bye